Hey, thank you for joining me and hanging out with me in my main gardens. It's Deb. And uh, it's been a few weeks since I've done an update from the raised beds. Um, because we've transitioned from busy, busy growing season into fall. Although things are still going and growing. And honestly, we've been really busy. I don't know if you can see behind me, but if you've been playing along with the patio home game, uh, David and I are installing our own patio. Actually, David's really doing the work. And finally, we got to the point where we're now laying pavers. It's all the prep that takes so long, drainage and stuff that he knows how to do that I don't know how to do, measuring, lines, I don't know. When he talks to me about it, I kind of go, whoa. Okay, let me, ju okay, just let me decorate it. <laughs> yeah, <Anyhow. laughs> that's why we're a good team. So we've been busy with that. And um, I've been busy with work. It's been a little crazy. And canning, I really got into canning this year because we had so many tomatoes and now I'm obsessed with it. And that will be a whole nother video. So where we are in the gardens right now, I'll give you a little walkabout. Um, we finally had a nice harvest of tomatoes late in the season, the large beauties, and I'm still getting a lot of little babies. A lot of little babies are still coming and I'm just kind of picking them and popping them and probably throw them in a salsa that I will can. Um, the peppers are really going and growing right now. And even though it's the end of September, we're getting some beautiful weather, so they should do well. I've got some broccoli. Um, I had a Brussels sprout plant that I pulled out because it had this worms and I just couldn't deal with it. So I'm like, you and your worms can go in the woods and live happily ever after. I pulled those out. I pulled um, a couple of the tomatoes out that have finished and I think that's been good and that's opened up some nice airflow for uh, my habanero peppers that are doing great. And then the cucumbers, I just harvested one yesterday. The leaves have turned into that kind of crunchy brown stuff. Um, yeah, and you know, just let it be. So we may grab, there may be a few more. I'm seeing a few blossoms, so I may still get a few more cucumbers. And then the squash, I'll take you down to the squash section because um, we've got some good squashes going and growing. So let's, let's do a little walk. Okay, so you can see your garden probably looks like this. Just kind of end of season. Um, but yeah, see these habaneros. I'm actually going to use one of these. Oh, I think gorge is. Yeah. So lots of buds on this baby. And I had a big tomato plant here. And on the other side, I took those out. And I think that this pepper is going to be very happy. Um, we've got some greens that I really need to eat, some broccoli, and I planted nasturtium seeds really late in the season, and I'm so glad I did because they're just so pretty, and I'm seeing a lot of bees on them, more nasturtium, and then I did put some radishes in here that I should probably, you know what, let's pull one out together, yeah, that didn't do very well. Well, I don't know. Um, I've got strawberries going. Jalapeno peppers are looking good. We've got some beauties happening. And it looks like we're gonna get some more coming in here and here. And this is actually doing really well right now um, with these fall temps. I don't have as much powdery mildew. I'm happy about that but if you look up here you can see all of these buds so I think we're gonna have a nice crop of squash and then kale I really need to oh yeah a few bugs there but I need to eat some kale oh look at that nice Nice. Oh, sad. Hell yeah. 
All right, so that's the latest and greatest from our raised beds. Um, in prior videos, I did kind of a Kornacki count of what we've harvested so far. I'm over it. <laughs> you know, we've transitioned to fall and um, I think we're all a little bit over it, but that's okay. We're still going and growing and we've still got some things to harvest here. And then I'm gonna start the cleanup process and I'll bring you with me for that. Um, let me show you the patio real quick, okay? And then um, we'll call it a day. So thanks for hanging out with me in my main gardens. Talk soon. All right, a little tour of the patio in process. Isn't it nice? This has been such a long time coming. This has been all summer. And obviously we have a lot more work to do. So that's our plan for the next few weekends. But yeah, David, oh, I don't think I'm supposed to step on this. Um, oops. <laughs> That'll be our little secret because he's got it all like laid out. Um, and then there's more patio pavers over there. So it's coming. Slowly but surely. And it will all be worth it.